Welcome, 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 Collective. Uh, thanks for tapping in. Thanks for stopping by. We're going to hop right into the messages to see um, what Spirit has for you here. I'm getting the energy that somebody feels threatened here. Okay, somebody feels threatened that somebody's, you know, after them or something like that here. So let's see what's here. Remember to take what resonates and to leave the rest for someone else. Yeah, somebody feels threatened. They feel like somebody's after them about something. Maybe something they did or said. So, what's here? Yeah. What's here, Holy Spirit? What's collective needs to know? What they need to be aware of? This could be happening at the present moment here. Hmm. Somebody could be feeling that somebody's after them or somebody wants to threaten them or something. Just feel it intuitively like something's not right. What's here, Holy Spirit? For the collective. Yeah, somebody, ooh, somebody's scared. Somebody's in a panic. Oh, yeah, somebody's definitely, definitely scared. Somebody's definitely in a panic here. Okay. Wow, that's what I was getting. Hmm. Somebody feels threatened by somebody. Because something's over here. Something is over. There's a, a yeah, a divine masculine here. I mean, a divine feminine here. That's done with somebody or... I'm getting that there's a, a karmic feminine that's threatening a divine feminine here over commitment. All right. Wow. Over a relationship there with somebody here. What else fell out? Yeah. Drama queen. Cold hearted. Cold hearted bitch. Yeah. I want somebody to be scared, feel threatened about <laughs> this divine feminine that's with this masculine here because they want something to be over. Okay, between you and this person, collective. So somebody could feel threatened by another uh, a karmic feminine energy here. A ice cold hearted bitch is what I'm getting here. Okay, thirsty, thirsty. Likes to cause chaos, a fucking drama queen. Who is this here? Who is this here? Holy Spirit. It's also could be a divine masculine reverse the roles when necessary. Okay. This could be past, present, or future events. What's here, Holy Spirit? Tell me about, oh, yep. Because they're obsessed with your person here. Okay. You may be with them. And, hey, this uh, this karmic person saying it ain't over. It's not over. They still desire your person here. Or they desire you. Take it how it resonates. <laughs> Somebody feels threatened. Mm-hmm. Somebody either wants somebody's romantic partner or somebody wants you collective I don't know if you don't left somebody they want you back they may have threatened you if you don't come back to them or something like that or they want, may want you to feel threatened you may feel this person may be coming after you or this could be another um, karmic, karmic energy just coming after you behind your person here okay because they want to be with your person they lust for your person okay or either somebody lusts for you hmm. I'm hearing all eyes on you so what's here, Holy Spirit? What else does the collective need to know? What they need to be aware of? Somebody's obsessing over you, collective, or obsessing over your person. Okay. Wow. This false twin flame here. What else is here? Somebody's false twin flame. They want somebody scared in a panic. They want somebody to feel threatened. Somebody feels threatened too, or they like somebody's coming after them, or something like that. It's the energy I'm getting here. Yeah, somebody wants to cause drama. We got a drama uh, queen here. Could be a drama king, but whoever they are, they thirsty for causing trouble here. Okay, hmm. Maybe somebody just broke up with somebody um, that you're in a long-term relationship with, and this person is obsessed with somebody here. They're not wanting to let go. Wow. They're being threatening here. What else is here? Either somebody's threatening you because you're you're with your person and they want your person there, lusting after your person. Take her resonate, put it where it go. You know your story better than I do. So what's here, Holy Spirit? Tell us more about this energy. Mm. I don't know. You may not you Hmm. Somebody is like 
I don't know. Somebody's in a committed relationship and somebody doesn't like that. Somebody is with somebody and there's somebody who wants to threaten you because you're with, with that person. Maybe you don't see this coming here. Okay. Hmm. Wow. I'm getting also... This person may try to box you in or trap you in. You know, box you in like... If you're driving or something like that, they may try to box you in just to start some trouble with you or something like that. Hmm. You could be seeing a lot of um, signs and synchronicities. You know, 11-11. Could be seeing 2-2-2, 3 3 Yeah. Somebody could be trying to box you in in traffic or something like that or catch you in traffic is what I'm getting here. There's a karmic that want to catch you in traffic because, well, yeah. Somebody is threatening somebody to break up with somebody because they want that person. They're obsessed with that person. They, they This is a cold-hearted bitch or a cold-hearted motherfucker. I mean, yeah. They want something to be over between you and your person here. They want, they want somebody threatened or to feel threatened or scared is what I'm getting here. Hmm. What else is here? Holy Spirit for the collective. Well, hmm. Somebody could be sending you spiritual attacks or something like that. Here, this drama coin, the drama cane could be sending you spiritual attacks, you know, hey, know you or whatever. Okay. This could be happening to you, Divine Masculine. Or this could be happening to you. There's a cold hearted person um, that wants you threatened, that wants you scared uh, because you don't want to be with them. Okay. Or you left them or you don't mess with them no more. Okay. I think you guys are supposed to be together forever. Yeah, this is a psychopath. Let's hear the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Somebody may be threatening somebody with, um, I don't know, some sort of support here. Financial support. Okay. The man mask, they, they may be hassling you about some type of financial support or something like that. Or threatening because you called it over. You called it quits. Okay, with this karmic here that you were dealing with that caused drama in your life here. Wow. They're sending you spiritual attacks. <laughs> wow, because they're still obsessed with you. You no longer have a desire for them is what I'm getting here. Wow. They feel like, you know, you had your cutoff game was strong. <laughs> you let their ass go. Oh, this could have been you, Divine Fam. This person could be threatening because you let their ass go. If, it ha if this hasn't happened yet, uh, it could happen in the next uh, few days or a few weeks, okay, or in the next few months here, okay. It's for somebody here, all right. Somebody's pissed off that they got ghosted, blocked, or cut off here. Mm-hmm. This is a karmic ex-romantic uh, partner somebody's here. Now they want to threaten somebody or want somebody to be scared. You know, I don't know what type of shit they may be doing to try to scare you, but this is the energy I'm getting here. What else is here, Holy Spirit? What's the collective need to be aware of? Wow. This person is crushed. Whoever this karmic is, they're crushed because of you, you have a strong cutoff game, whoever you are. Uh, divine Femme, Divine Masculine, you let this person go. All right. You found out you was dealing with a cold-hearted drama king or a drama king. They were obsessed and you got the fuck away from, from them. Okay. They was for certain they would have you forever is what I'm hearing. But you're done. You're left this karmic alone. Now they want you scared or in a panic or something. They Maybe they're sending you some threats or something like that. Maybe you're in a commitment with somebody new and they want to threaten you because you don't want to be with them anymore. Hmm. What else is your Holy Spirit? Yeah, you're on your spiritual path here. Okay. You leveled up on this person. Okay. You leveled up on this karmic, whoever this karmic is that's pissed off that you're with somebody else or you left their obsessed ass behind. They're trying to send you spiritual attacks here. Okay. Somebody wants you crushed. Somebody wants you to feel threatened because you walked away from them. Okay. Wow. Hmm. Yeah. This person may even be stalking you. Okay. 
They may be stalking you. <laughs> they may not know where to find you right now. I don't know. Or if they find you, they, you know, want you to be scared or because you moved on away from them, you blocked their ass off. I'm saying you have a strong cutoff game, whoever you are. You left this cold hearted drama king or drama king behind. Well, yeah, because you felt weighed down in the relationship. This person was only trying to hold you back here. Okay, you got away from this karmic. Now this karmic is feeling crushed. And they want some type of revenge because you left them. All right, they were obsessed, too obsessed. All right, too obsessed. Some Somebody had to walk away from their family here. Okay, because there was just, I mean, like, they just put enough time in and they felt trapped. Realizing the person that they were with was trying to play them or something like that. Somebody's ex was trying to play them or something and you dropped drop their ass and now they pissed off because you, you don't, you know what I'm saying, you're not taking a risk on being with this person anymore. Like, you're not taking a gamble with your life anymore. You're on your spiritual path. This karmic is pissed off about that. Yeah, because they wanted to entrap you some kind of type of way. Keep you stuck with them, you know. Lie to you. Whatever whatever it would take for them to, you know, keep some kind of attachment with you. Alright, now they want to threaten you because you don't want to be with them. Well. Some of you are with somebody, somebody else. They want to threaten you. Somebody wants to cut somebody off in traffic, too, as well. Somebody want to box somebody in. Hmm. Because they're crushed. They're crushed. They're feeling crushed. They're sad. They're broken. But they were like, I don't know. This person was too obsessed for you. Um, divine Femme, Divine Masculine. You had to get away from this person, okay? You seen and you felt what this person was trying to do to you. You felt the obsession. You know, wow. And that they could be cold hearted for some of you and me too as well. All right. This person doesn't like the fact that <laughs> they couldn't keep you stuck. They couldn't keep you stuck, okay? What else is your Holy Spirit? This person is having a meltdown. This karmic is having a meltdown. Okay, they, they, they want you to feel through. Yeah. They want some retaliation. Because you walked away from their ass. They want, they want to punish you. They want some type of payback revenge. Is what I'm getting here. Wow. Hmm. I don't know. I'm hearing they on the prowl. Whatever that means, they on the prowl. So they could be looking for you if they don't know where you went to. Nobody's talking, nobody's telling them. For some of you, they asking questions about where you are. Maybe asking your family members, friends, they can't find you. You may just be keeping your distance from this person because you know they're crazy. I'm getting that they're crazy. Yeah. You guys were different. Like something's over. Something's final. Like you don't want to be with this person. Now they want some type of punishment or payback because you no longer have a desire for this person. Now they want to threaten you because you don't want to be with them. Whoa. Yep. Somebody's angry here because somebody didn't want to make a proposal to them here. Somebody walked away from somebody because they know that, that there was two or more people that they were involved with here. Okay. I'm also picking up that there could be two or more people that are planning or discussing um, a ways to like uh, threaten you because you walked away from this karmic uh, person here. This, yeah. And you called it over. Now they want retaliation here. They want some type of payback. Okay. This person doesn't like to lose. Who, whoever we're picking up on here. This karmic. They don't like to lose. Okay. Hmm. Wow. Maybe somebody. This karmic feels like they're losing some type of support. It, since you walked away from them. Okay. But you, they're full of drama. You don't have no desire for this person here. 
okay but they're sending you spiritual attacks they want you to be scared they want you to panic they want you to feel threatened because you don't want to be with them wow yeah because they're toxic they're toxic they have unhealthy behaviors here okay are they be around unhealthy people too as well with unhealthy behaviors they're, they're, they're with toxic people okay wow hmm what else is here holy spirit what else do they need to know what else do they need to be aware of please and thank you tell us more about this karmic energy they're in denial they don't want to face the fact that you walked away from them or you no longer have a desire to be with this person so this person is feeling pretty lost right now okay and they want to project all of their misery onto you because you moved on but you moved on because they were very toxic okay now they can want some retaliation because you don't want them back all right um wow they can want some type of payback or revenge here i mean they are art they are about starting drama here especially when you told them it's over i'm done you know you completed the cycle with this person wow divine film divine masculine but this person's in denial they're they're not accepting this lost is what i'm getting here they feel lost without you so they're not accepting this loss they want you to feel threatened like like they could threaten you to be back with them or something like that or threaten to get money from you or threaten i don't know threatening they're just trying to be threatening okay wow what else is here holy spirit yeah this part this karma is very emotional right about now they may just try to pop up you know stop by give you a surprise visit or something like that you know what i'm saying just try to pop up maybe on your job um tell you to meet them somewhere they may try to box you in because this person is angry that you no longer want to be with them okay they're in denial that the relationship is over they want some retaliation here this could be a karmic ex as well um that we're picking up on divine from divine masculine your karmic ex is wanting to box you in somewhere okay like they can have two or more people that's, you know, riding with them on the shit, you know, to come against you is what I'm getting here, okay? Or they could have some some of their family members, okay? Some of their karmic ass family members riding with them to uh, threaten you, all right? Hmm. What else is here? Well, they want you to feel threatened because you walked away. You left their karmic asses behind here. Okay, you can't make it up, look. They want you to be threatened. They want to threaten you. Okay. Wow. Wow. They're embarrassed. Or maybe they feel like you embarrassed them because you left their ass. Okay. Because they were obsessed. They were karmic. They were toxic. You know. They they were had unhealthy behaviors. And they was around unhealthy people with unhealthy ass behaviors. And you had a spiritual awakening. You got away from this person. You got a wake up call. You got away from this obsessed ass, crazy ass, psychotic karmic. Now they want to send you some spiritual attacks. Okay, they want you scared and in a panic. They want to threaten you. But some of y'all saw and their family members want to threaten you too. Hmm. Yeah. I just see somebody's, you know, karmic partner. Their, their ex is what I'm getting here. Yeah. Wow. This karmic ex may feel like your person came in between the relationship. Okay. So get a third party uh, karmic here. Okay. Wow, somebody wants to teach somebody a lesson here. This drama king, a drama queen. Want to threaten somebody because they're going through it. You know what I'm saying? They're all in their emotions and shit. Now that they don't have you no more. Okay? They feel like nobody should have came in between y'all. Just triggered this person. <clears throat> Just triggered this person. Okay? Because all they can think about is being with you or being with your person. Okay? Whoever this karmic is. Okay? Wow. Somebody's about the spill of tea. On something that happened in the past. Okay, somebody's about to spill the tea. Somebody's about to reveal, confess something about something that happened in the past here with that, with this karmic, this toxic karmic that you let go of. Okay, tell us more about this toxic karmic. Holy Spirit, please and thank you. Hang on, I gotta find this card collector right here. Racing. They're coming towards you. You may be running from this person or avoiding this person or you may have to get away from this person really fast here. But this person wants to return to your life or return to your person's life. 
yeah so yeah you could be running from somebody collective or avoiding this person and this person is racing towards you they want you to be scared they want you to be in a panic but you're divinely protected so no worries there yeah right now in the moment you are prote protected spirit said from this toxic ass person here you're protected and their toxic friends or family members whoever the fuck they are okay they can't mind their fucking business okay what else is here holy spirit you are divinely protected from this karmic whoever you are but yeah they could be stalking you and watching you okay spirit's just putting you on alert okay because this person is feeling crushed that you walked away from them okay that you no, no, no longer want to have anything to do with them yeah they're definitely stalking you watching you wherever you are okay are they coming looking for you is what i hear hmm. yeah the pressure cooker here okay this karma can stand the fact that you could possibly be happy with someone else okay you could possibly be having a love affair with someone else and this karma wow it's, it's a rage it's like they're angry like yeah it crushes them to know that you'll be with somebody else okay makes them very unhappy here okay that you could just show your love to someone else adore someone else you know or admire somebody else other than them wow this is an insecure motherfucker here or insecure bitch one more spirit before i close this out yeah they could be uh stalking you okay it's very sad like if you have any social media and this person has been you know like harassing your social media or trying to connect to you uh some type of way through the internet or i don't know trying to gain access to you or whatever you don't want to have anything to do with this person don't leave a trail for this person to be able to find you if you're in fact running from this person or trying to avoid this person okay like don't leave a trail for them to to be able to find you you know like um especially like social media because the only thing they have to do is like you know look up your name and then look up maybe who you've been talking to they could try to find out you know where you are or something like that though this is for the ones who's avoiding someone avoiding their ex or running from their ex because there's somebody's ex that's running towards them because they don't want it to be over they want to threaten you they want you scared or in a pack because they're unhappy that you're in a love affair with someone else here or you could possibly possibly be in a love affair with somebody else they're looking for you if they can't find you or if they know where you are they're watching you they're stalking you this person is very angry they're enraged as a matter of fact okay especially if you got in a relationship with somebody else yeah they're angry very very angry okay they want to threaten you on them they want i'm getting the they want to I'm, unplug yourself from I'm, unplug from social media unplug from toxic people around you just unplug from all the motherfuckers just unplug because this motherfucker is looking for you watching you stalking you trying to find you if they don't know where you at okay that's what i'm getting it could be a uh this might pop up somewhere okay because they they are in denial about you not wanting to be with them this is the energy i'm picking up here okay wow this person is very immature okay when it comes to knowing how to you know like Hold, hold their self together you know have their shit together they, they're very immature okay they act out i'm hearing they act out you know they're very childish you know when it comes to like have a fit when they can't have their way you know what i'm saying like yeah wow what else is here spirit said just unplug okay shit if you're single just stay single you know what i'm saying like or if you ain't single you know your current status may be single or you may be available to shit but there's a toxic person that's, you know what I'm saying, that wants you back. Okay? Your past love. Wow. Or you could be hooking up with a person right now that could be single. But some of y'all, something else I'm picking up. Okay? Spirit said, don't do it. Find out more about this person first. Find out why they single. What happened in their last rela re relationship? Should the other person have to run? Because this person, whoever this person is... They're not picking up on this energy. This 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 person likes to threaten people when they leave. They they're very immature. They're very childish. They can't stand rejection and they they act out in a very negative way. Okay, so wow. Ooh. Mm. This person, like I said, 
they could even be trying to meet you or date you divine friend divine um, master find out what, who they was with in the past and, 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 and what happened you know do a background check on their ass or something like that okay why wow, because whoever hook up with this person it's going to be hard for them to get away from them because they're going to threaten you if you try to leave okay for some of y'all it's already happened for some of y'all it's something that that's, could be projected in the next few days weeks or months here okay is what I'm getting here all right, stay safe, collective. That's what I have for you now. Till next time, namaste. If nobody told you they love you today, I love you today.